Hi everyone, welcome back to Wholesome Living. I hope all of you are doing great. Uh, we are doing well, but the heat in Siliguri has been so extreme that we decided to uh, take a short trip up to a place called Lepcha Jagat, which is very close to Darjeeling. It's an offbeat destination and we wanted to get away from the heat as well as avoid big crowds. So we decided to go to this place. Do watch the video till the end and also tell us how you like the video. Here we are in Siliguri, we are near the Mahananda bridge getting a jeep to Darjeeling and we are going to get off at Goom railway station and we were very lucky to see the Darjeeling Himalayan railway go by as we were heading up towards Goom and we also caught a glimpse of this beautiful procession that was taking place for Buddha Purnima. Finally, we here at the homestay and since the weather was so gloomy and uh, it was getting cold outside so we quickly sat down to have a really good uh, steaming lunch that was kept ready for us. Once we were done with lunch, we decided to take a hike up the hill to a sunrise point and we also decided to go through this uh, beautiful pine forest which is on the way to sunrise viewpoint and uh, we just went up there to watch the view and to kind of enjoy some peace and quiet up there at the top of the hill. The weather was quite clear and it was really pleasant when we finally reached the top of the hill and we were exhausted so we sat on the benches that were there and our niece uh, happily got uh, to sit on the swing and was enjoying herself. As we were all enjoying uh, our time up at the top of the hill, the weather suddenly changed within a few minutes and uh, the fog started engulfing the whole place and uh, it began drizzling and before we knew it there were big large drops of rain falling and you can see them on the camera as well these huge drops of rain and the fog also that has become quite thick and it was really beautiful to see the fog and also a bit eerie as we were going through the forest and before we knew it uh, the rain had subsided so Kavita and myself decided to take a walk down the road and just explore uh, what was further down the hill. While returning to the homestay, we decided to take another trip up the hill to uh, the sunrise viewpoint and we got this beautiful, beautiful view of Darjeeling which was covered in uh, sun as well as in the shadow of the clouds. The horizon is quite foggy and uh, covered in clouds so we could not really get a clear view of Kanchanjunga although we could see a few of the peaks but it was very very hazy so we decided to return to the homestay and have a good cup of tea with some pakoras as the moon came up over the horizon we just sat on the terrace and enjoyed watching the moon gradually rise the next day I was lucky enough to see the moon actually going down while I was going to see the sunrise. It's around 4.45 and the sun has just started creeping over the horizon. The weather is clearing up much much better than yesterday and you can see the Kanchanjunga range in the distance. Uh, this place is really really incredible to visit and if you want a clear view of Kanchanjunga as well as a beautiful sunrise the best time to visit here would be in October November when the weather is the is at its best and there's plenty of snow that you can see 
right across the horizon uh, along the Kanchanjunga range. Uh, thanks for watching till the end and goodbye for now.